Today we're heading through Sweetman on the way over to Millstone. Did you ever have one of those riding days where odd things happen? Like maybe you end up in the grass and almost crash but save it at the last second right before you hit a tree? Or maybe a truck pulls out right in front of you less than a minute later? Or maybe you just start making random left and right turns and just by some stroke of luck you find a really cool new road to ride on? That's just the kind of day I'm having. I've been exploring all over this area the past few weeks and I stumbled upon this cool road called Backbone Hill. It does seem to have a spine shape when you look at it from overhead. And these shaded hills that I'm ripping through are blast. There's a lot of farms back in this area growing all sorts of things. And we're not too far from the Millstone River. I don't know that this guy ever saw me, but I definitely saw him. I don't blame that guy, but it's definitely something that us motorcyclists need to be aware of. There's all sorts of blind spot driveways and openings where trucks can be backing out of at any time and any place along our ride, so we always have to have our guard up. I've been studying a lot of crash videos lately, and although some of them are unavoidable, many of them are caused by rider error or just not being vigilant enough, and an even larger majority of them are caused by ego. There's lots of people crashing either trying to show off doing stunts or trying to go too fast through the twisties or feeling disrespected in traffic. I've been telling myself to leave my ego at home before I head out and it's really been working. It's not like I'm obligated to set a new lap record by my sponsors when I'm just chilling out and cruising around town. So hey guys, let me know if you leave your ego at home before you head out, or if you like to show off and get crazy on the road. I love to hear some good stories, so definitely drop them on us in the comments. We hope you enjoy the ride, and don't forget to subscribe so that we can bring you more